hundred years shouldn't make any difference when it's been sitting there for 65 million. Yeah. You would think. Alright. So who would take the sunstone? I think it's time to go talk to people. I was like... Well, I just because I want to kick his ass again because I hate that guy. Ozzy is uh, 600 BC. Hmm. This is his descendant, though. No wonder. Ozzy the Eighth. Still honor the statue of Ozzy the First in the village square. Wait. The statue of. There was no statue of Ozzy the First here before. It was Magus. Interesting. Aha. Uh -huh. Oh, great Ozzy. Huh. Even those miserable Creepy. sunny days abate when we see their lovely balded plate pace. <laughs> oh, the black omen, the black omen. Let us pray a prayer to the black omen. Hey, yeah, black omen's here, too. Mm -hmm. Alright, I don't think it's here. There's the black omen. Right above what's his face's house. He should be happy about that. Mm hmm. Black Owen, looming in the sky, made by the hands of neither fiend nor man. What does it pretend? Oh, you know what it is. <laughs> Don't play dumb, Melchior. Right? Yeah. Uh, who else would be a dick and take the sunstone? <laughs> ah! Could it be right there? Where, yeah, there's this shininess coming from your house. I knew it was this guy. Moonstone? Never heard of it. Dad loves money more than he loves me. Can't my dad more than anyone in the whole world. Children are slipping away from us. It's so painful to see. Well, maybe if your husband wasn't such a dick. Yeah. You. You've got it, don't you? Where's the day's greedy? It's not true, is it? I don't know, but I'm taking whatever you've got here. Because I am greedy. <laughs> I was saving that tent to go camping. Yeah, well, camp indoors. Alright, you douche. Alright. What do we, we got to talk around town then. We know you have it. Yes, because it's glowing like the friggin' sun. I'm going to fear too. I'm going to grass the fair. Okay. Blah, blah, blah. Snail shop. Some monsters can be a piano player. As soon as you own, if you die, trying to buy a great forest on first north, sad tale. Runs off the festival, eventually the slobs. Burp. It's a spice jerky, I'm saving it for a special occasion. Fine, I'll buy it. Now we have the spice nice. jerky from our old side quest. Yes. Which we may continue. <laughs> okay, you're not telling me anything. How about the inn? You think someone could tell you something? I think I actually have to go to 600 AD and change his family so they're not stuck up jackasses. Really? Yeah. Interesting. And, uh... Then, uh... Then the sun moonstone, or sunstone, will still be where we need it. Huh. Okay, but we've got the jerky now, so we're gonna go visit the king. Mm -hmm. Who, if you recall, this guy said... He says, but like spice jerky. Because if you recall, they were having, you know, this father-daughter spat. Yeah. Because she was being stupid and lied to by the guy, and then accused her father of killing her mother by not caring. There he is. I'd forgotten about that. You've forgotten about that? Yeah. After the death queen Eliza, Princess Nadia became as gracious as entire world. But, you know, she's stupid and selfish and doesn't notice that her father dotes on her constantly. Mm. What have you come here for? You have no business in this place. What's that? Y your favorite. Brought this for me? Let's see. What? What is it, Your Grace? How could you? 
Give me something spicy when you know quite well I have high blood pressure. What? But it's your favorite. This is the last straw. Now I truly know how much you hate me. Father, no, I... Leave now and never show your face here again. Father! That sucks. That's all this guy is doing. Mm -hmm. Oh dear. Oh dear. Oh dear. Oh dear. Oh dear. <laughs> Alright. Here's my team is so strict with her. Blah blah blah. We talked to you before. Maybe I need to go back in time again? I don't think so. Huh. I'm pretty sure somebody in this town knows the story. Out with you. Spice jerky. It's an old fan of recipe. One I'm afraid I don't have, but here's quite popular and poor these days. My wife, the old leader runs the kitchen, has got to mm -hmm. try around here. She doesn't cook goose for anyone, she doesn't got a temper, cook your goose, she's running the family. Okay. Let's try the other side. Or maybe we just go up and talk to the old coot again. I don't know. Mm -hmm. I'm Pierre, Royal, Royal Legal Counsel. The king has been terribly distraught since the princess ran off. Took some time, I was able to convince him that no kidnapping took place. Chancellor, on the other hand, has been acting quite strangely. Just discussing that now. Since I hired all the guards who manned the prison towers. Yeah, I know what's going on here, I just can't remember how to get it to go. Yeah. Chancellor may have been purposely trying to influence his grace's judgment in the courtroom. These prison guards were an odd bunch. Even we would get cold stares from time to time. Those eyes, like they weren't even human. Yeah. Because they weren't. Mm -hmm. It was right around the time we ordered the dragon tank to be built. That was when the chances started to act differently. Mm. Maybe I can confront him now. Maybe. Hmm. Maybe she's being no, that shouldn't matter. She doesn't need to be in the front of the party. She doesn't know see anybody right now. Chris hasn't left his bed. I don't think he's ill. He just has a heavy heart right now. It's firmly sealed. Ma bitch, I got a sword! What? Okay. So, do we do this wrong? No. I know giving him the jerky was part of it. At least I'm pretty sure. Hmm. There's somebody over here we can talk to. There's someone else we can uh. talk to. Blah. blah, blah. Personal tutor. So tutor me. Oh, it's the doll. <laughs> hmm. Hmm. All right. It's time to do our time travel mojo. Because mm. I think we need to go back in time anyway to make that dude's family less dicks anyway. Yeah. And while we're at it. We can, uh... Check and see what's going on. Yeah, maybe we can, uh... Help watch what's going, what's on. going on here. <laughs> He's picking you. Please go and speak to him. You're alive. Thank heavy casualties. Thanks to your battles. One of us work out your bills. So anyway, the team might repay us. That's you. She had done. Generations. See, the generations to come know the name of Chrono. Who's brought Glenn here? If they've broken through the rubble, you can survive and emerge from the female keep who you are. Hmm. Hmm. 
Where's Glenn? Where's that froggy guy that I'm screwing around with on the side? Yeah. <laughs> Alright, let's go uh, to the south here and fix this guy's... Um, screwed up family. Mm -hmm. I want some spiced jerky. I wonder if I could make. I'm gonna tie this bride one day. Place known as the Magic Caves, live east of the Denodora Mountains. Okay. Done that. Somebody's been in hand down for generations. Let's slice it, thin them. If we can open them, they'll be mine. Mm -hmm. blah, 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 blah. Unless you were supposed to give her the spice of jerky. Item in size reacting. Remove the mm -hmm. item, yes. White vest. Okay, so this is just. Might as well. Black vest. Maybe I'm in the wrong house. Maybe it's the next door. Mm. Or not. No, I think that's the right house. Market in Tavern. They don't have any spice jerky here, do they? Our hero or I'm just playing. Uh, I don't think so. I have a little dream of my own, you know. Hee hee. If I get a good mo could be a good mother to that boy. What? Huh? <laughs> Who? What? Tells me very hard lately. He must have learned his lesson. Sorry, Frogman, Bested Magus. I had gone and slew the fiend myself, and I knew it'd be that easy. Jerks. <laughs> hmm. I'm at a loss for what we're supposed to do here. Mm hmm. I suppose we could always try our hand at this crap again. Oh, good. We got Chrono in the party now. Yeah. Still gonna be hard, probably. We up. Oh, we are going to need. Uh, put him in the party. Mm. Wait, didn't he get something cool? Yeah, I thought he got something cool. I think he got a new weapon. Oh, yeah, I thought he got it. Yeah, yeah, we already put it on him. Okay. Mm -hmm. Power glove. You know what? I need to bl spend my tabs. Tabs? Yeah. But I don't know who to spend them on. Maybe I'll spend them all on Chrono. And magic capsules. Ah. Uh. Strength capsules. Probably should give them all to Chrono. I don't know. Since he's back. I don't know if I'd give them all to him. Make him a super soldier. Speed capsules. Uh, but we were equipping people's equipment. Mm -hmm. Trying to figure out what would be best. And the ruby armor appears to be best. Yes. <sighs> You're not in the party. Yes! Okay. Hmm. I don't think he hits us with uh, fire damage, did he? I don't think so. This is MP component assumption of 50. Let's do that. Alright. It's an earring. Yes. So how does he wear it? Ah. Uh, um. Uh, who knows? Frog's ears are kind of funny, you know? <laughs> frogs don't have ears. Well, they have these, like... I think they have these, like, whole things, but I don't think you could equip an earring there. <laughs> Alright. That's all I'm saying. My potion. Maybe it's a tongue ring for him. What was that? Yeah, there we go. Alright, it's Mr. Pelvis. Oh, no, not Mr. Eater. Pelvis. Pelvis Eater? For the earth. Ugh. <laughs> to come up anywhere. 
I don't know what you'd call him, but pelvis eater is just wrong. Well, his pelvis eats you, so that's why I came yeah. with that, but that was clearly wrong. Yeah. <laughs> Incorrect, that is. Hey everyone, this is Angel. Just wanted to say thank you for watching this video. If you enjoyed it, please do us a super huge favor and click on the like buttons below. And if you want to leave a comment, please do that too, because we'd appreciate that as well. If you'd like to see the next in the series, please click this link. If you'd like to see some of our other videos, please click this link. And don't forget to subscribe. Thanks again, and I will see you next time. Bye!